Generally, restaurants combine a group of items to make a combo. For example, a combo can contain a starter, a main course, and a drink. We can also have a burger combo with burger, fries and a drink. The combo allows combining groups of items that are generally ordered together as one single item. In this video, we will see how to create a combo item on Dine Connect. For this, we first need to create combo groups. On Dine Connect, go to the Combo Group page, under the Menu section on the Connect module. Here, you can see the list of existing combo groups. Now, let us create combo groups for a burger combo, which gives the option to select one burger out of four burger options, one drink from three drink options, and a fries. Let us create these groups one by one. For this, click on Create Combo Group button. This page opens. Here first, give a name to the combo group. Add sort order. Minimum selectable and maximum selectable numbers here. For burger, we will give minimum as 1 and maximum as 1. Now, we need to give the options to select from. For this, click on Add Item button. This pop-up opens. Here, to select from the existing menu items, click on the menu item button. Select the required items one by one. We can see the selected item here. Now we can add the price for the item. If the price is not added here, then it takes the default price defined on the item. Add a sort order, quantity, add a group name if required. Change the color of the button. Auto select button is to select the item automatically when the combo item is selected. After all the details are added, click on the save button. Similarly, select the rest of the burger options. Once all the burger options are selected, save the combo group. Now let's create a drink combo. We will again select Create Combo Group button. Add the name. Sort order. Minimum and maximum selectable. Now we will add the drink options one by one. Once all the drink options are selected we shall save the group. Lastly, we will also add the fries. For this, again we will create a group, add the name and other details. Now for the fries option, we will provide only one French fries option that will be auto-selected when this combo group is selected. For this, once we select French fries, we will mark this auto select button and save the group. Once all the groups are created, now we need to create the combo item. For this, we will go to the menu item page and click on create menu item. Here fill in all the details as explained in the menu items video. Refer to the menu item video to know more about the information that needs to be filled in on these pages. 
Here in this video, we will only discuss the elements where the configuration changes while creating a combo item. In the product type, select the type as combo. As soon as this is selected, you can see a new section called combo will be visible. Fill in all the details here, and now we will go to the combo page. Here we will select all the combo groups we created earlier and link them to this item. To select the combo groups, click on the Select Combo Group button. Select all the groups and then save. You will also be able to create the combo groups directly on this page as well, by clicking on the Create Combo Group button. Follow the same steps as explained earlier. When the list button here is clicked, you can see the list of items in that combo group. The add button allows you to further add any item to the combo group. Now save the combo item. This way you can create the combo items with options as required. You can filter the items based on their product type by selecting the type in this section. Note that the items can be edited or deleted as required by clicking on the respective action in the Actions column. Thanks for watching the video. Do check out our other videos to understand more on how to use the Level 5 products.